when we talk about the power of housing, it's kind of useful to think about it as a bowl. I heard somebody say one time that you can make a cake without a bowl, but it's hard and it's sloppy and it's probably not going to taste as good as one you make with a bowl. So affordable housing is like that bowl. If somebody has an affordable house, that will help them succeed in life. It, we know that people who have affordable housing are better students, they do better at work, and they, do, they have better health outcomes. So we're trying to build that bowl to help people succeed in life. Affordable housing is also really great for the community because it creates jobs when we build houses, it increases the tax base so that we can have better schools and libraries in the community, better roads. So we think of affordable housing as a win-win for the community. So our service area is what's known as a persistent poverty area, and that means that we've had poverty rates in excess of 20% for at least 30 years. Actually, in our case, it's been since the 1960s, which is when we started measuring poverty rate. And the, the challenge of working in a persistent poverty area is it's that you have layers of challenges. And so it's not just a, a, a business went out and people are suddenly poor. It's people have been poor for generations. The Colonels have been a longtime supporter of ours and, and we've gotten almost, I think, close to 10 grants and it's supported all of our programs. You've helped us buy some um, uh, furniture for our rental units for homeless folks. Uh, you supported the acquisition of a couple of trucks that we use with the construction so that we're able to rehab and build house. And most recently, you helped us purchase some energy efficient hot water heaters that will help save the homeowners um, uh, quite a bit of money on their energy bill every month. So when we actually get people moved into a new home, the thing that we have to think about a lot is how do we keep that person housed? And for us, when we're doing this type of work, energy efficiency becomes crucial because that's gonna help that person maintain that home. It's gonna make them able to afford to stay there and it makes that program more sustainable. And it also helps the community because the more you see other people in a nice home, the more other people want that too. And so they ask questions and we can educate them on energy efficiency and bring that to more families in Eastern Kentucky. Thank you, Kentucky Colonels, for your generosity in helping the Housing Development Alliance accomplish our mission in Eastern Kentucky. We really do appreciate the help, and, and I just wish you had the opportunity to see what a difference the houses make in people's lives. Thanks very much. Thank you.